Meghan Markle's dad committed ultimate betrayal and now unlikely to see royal grandchild. Thomas Markle's chances of seeing his royal grandchild are slim to none after he committed the ultimate betrayal and published an emotional handwritten letter from Meghan, according to royal commentator Victoria Arbiter. Meghan Markle sent a handwritten letter to her father last August where she pleaded for him to stop lying. But Mr. Markle decided last week to publish the letter. Meghan used the heartbreak in personal note to highlight on the pain her father had put her through following numerous press stunts prior to her wedding to Prince Harry. Royal commentator Victoria Arbiter told Inside Edition, It's heartbreaking, isn't it? This is, at the end of the day. A daughter pleading with her father to keep this between the two of them to stop playing it out in the media. M's arbiter added, To me, this is the ultimate betrayal and what a tragedy. He does have grandchildren already but this is his first grandchild with Meghan and I think the chances of him meeting this grandchild are slim to none. Thomas Markle has at times begged for his daughter to reach out. But in other interviews, he has also called her superior and branded the royal family as a cult. Just three months before Meghan sent the letter, Mr. Markle had pulled out of his daughter's wedding to Prince Harry due to health complaints, following the row over staging paparazzi photographs. The letter emerged following an anonymous interview given by five of Meghan's closest friends with People magazine last week where they revealed their concerns about the rumors around Meghan Markle. The Mail on Sunday published the extracts from the letter which Mr. Markle said left him feeling devastated. After releasing the five-page letter Meghan wrote to him, Mr. Markle has threatened to leak out more of the letter which has been published across the world. Part of the letter reads, Your actions have broken my heart into a million pieces, not simply because you have manufactured such unnecessary and unwarranted pain, but by making the choice to not tell the truth as you are puppeteered in this. Something I will never understand. You've told the press that you called me to say you weren't coming to the wedding, that didn't happen because you never called. Mr. Markle described the letter as a dagger to the heart which left him devastated. He commented, This is not the girl I know. It's not the way she talks. This letter is cold. When she signs off it's Meg. You read the way it ends and it felt like a final farewell to me.